Hello, welcome to Sparks 1524. I'm Nathaniel Miller. 2022 is nearly upon us. In a few short days, 2021 becomes last year. Now, the current last year had me living in Silverdale, Washington, making plans to move from there to Tennessee. This year, I left Washington State in May and actually ended up in Tennessee by July after a couple month road trip. I was, just got into Tennessee, was ready to start house hunting when uh, circumstances shifted again for my family. I have family in Tennessee and family here in Florida where I grew up. So I ended up moving down here to Florida and settling in Pensacola. I thought it'd be nice to take this last broadcast episode of Sparks 1524 for 2021 and take a look back at the adventures I've had this year, going from Washington Strait in the great Pacific Northwest to the Sunshine State here on the Gulf Coast. <music>
2021 is now winding down and about to become last year. I do hope that your 2022 is a good year. I hope it's easier on all of us than this last couple of years have been. We have all been through a lot together. And not just the um, <clears throat> unspecified virus of um, <clears throat> unknown origin. Uh, just this past, just this month, those horrible tornadoes ran through the heartland of our country. Uh, I was in Whitesville, Kentucky, and missed by the and the big tornado, the one that just that's gotten so much coverage because it flattened Mayville completely. It missed us by just a couple of miles. The people I was staying with, we were up literally past midnight watching the weather radar and watching the thing track toward us and go south, and we didn't know if we were going to get hit. So it's been a hard year for a lot of people for many reasons. Life is still going on, though. You may feel powerless because, oh, there's so little I can do. Well, do the little you can, because that little, if everybody does a little, and think about that, there's 300, just in our country, there's 330 million people. If 330 million of us all do just a little for something good, that's a lot of effort towards something good. So never be afraid, never hesitate to do the little you can, because the little you can do might mean buckets and loads to whoever you do it for. I sincerely hope that next year is easier on all of us. Even if it's not, I still encourage you to think independently, to experience wonder. Most of all, go out and keep doing great things. Happy New Year. See you in 2022.